clear job aspects in this video we will learn about some important current affairs information what happened during this period in our state as well as at country level and also international level come to the first one the pharmaceutical company manufacturing vaccines with bsl3 high containment facilities in india which company adopted that bsl3 facilities in the manufacturing of vaccines here four options are there randax laboratories arc biotech petro labs Denmark Pharmaceuticals. So the answer is Bharat Biotech, based at Hyderabad, Chennai Valley. This is the company which adopts BSL3 facilities. BSL3 bio safety level at three stages. And then this company is manufacturing uh, tablets and injectables. And uh, Petro Labs recently, this company launched one injectable that is Covifer, that which contains uh, Remdesivir. And similarly, this company, Denmark Pharmaceuticals, this company launched recently uh, a drug for COVID-19. That is fabi food. So, out of these four, Bharat Biotech is manufacturing vaccines, and this company is the only company in India which is practicing BSL3 facilities, biosafety level facilities. Next, second one. What is the new test arrived to diagnose the disease tuberculosis? Here, a viral test is this test is this test is meant for typhoid. Try it out. This test is meant for HIV and IGRAS interferon gamma rays assay. This is the new test arrived to diagnose. Tuberculosis and the CBC means complete blood count. So answer is C. And third one. Prime Minister Atma Nirbhar Fund Yojana. This program launched on 28th June of 28th June. And this program, Government of India decided to help option A retail traders this is not correct answer and option B wholesale traders this is not correct answer and option C street vendors and this is a correct answer option C this uh, through this fund street vendors they will get 10, 000, up to 10,000 rupees with a zero interest Next, fourth one, commencement of World Asteroids Day. So this is not uh, correct answer and C is not correct answer and B is correct answer. In 2016, Association of Space Explorers and United Nations Organization, they decided to conduct World Asteroids Day on 30th June from 2016 onwards. So why they decided to conduct World Asteroids Day on 30th June? In 1908, in Russia, Siberia region, on 30th June, near Tunguska River, One big forest area is there, Podakiman forest area. 
that area was hit by a big asteroid in 2016 in 1908 30th June. So to recall the memories of 30th June 1908, the destruction of that asteroid, UNO and Association of Space Explorers, they decided from 2016 onwards, on 30th June of every year, they decided to conduct World Asteroids Day. Recently, which Indian Institute of Technology introduced a BSc online course? IIT Kharagpur. Now this is this one and IIT Bombay, not this one, and IIT Delhi, not this one, and IIT Chennai recently launched BSc online course for the first time in India. Find out the different one. ICMR head Balram Barkov, Indian Council of Medical Research, headquarters Delhi. Next, NIV, National Institute of Virology, Dr. Priya Braha. This is located at Pune, Maharashtra. And next, Central Drug Standard Control Organization, and VG Somani, headquarters Delhi. Next, NCDC, National Center for Disease Control at Sujit Kumar and headquarters Delhi. If you observe these four answers, the different one is NIV, National Institute of Virology is located at Pona and remaining three ICMR, CVS, CO and NCDC, these three are located at Delhi. The different one is National Institute of Virology is located at Pune. Next, recently, which state in India introduced neonatal care ambulances? Not Tamil Nadu state, not Kerala state, not Telangana state, and Andhra Pradesh state recently introduced neonatal care ambulance. Neonatal care ambulance means the ambulance which are meant especially up to 5 years, from 0 to 5 years children. Next, which state of India very recently started conducting of Farmers Day? That is not Kerala state, not Karnataka state, not Maharashtra, Andhra Pradesh state. Just today only, there is 8th Zore, where the government of Andhra Pradesh decided to celebrate Farmers Day. On the birthday of former Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh State, late OS Last Secretary. Next, ninth one. What is the aim of P612? The aim of P612 is to recognize the asteroids and also to recognize the possibility of asteroids to hit the earth and also to inform the governments. That is the, those are the functions of B612. This last one. Which drug company recently launched injectable for COVID-19? That is Hetero Labs, Hyderabad based company launched Covifer, which is a 100 ml injectable and that contains Remdesivir. Thank you very much for watching this video and like, share and subscribe.